Ähm, aktuell teste ich bei 35 Grad 80 Prozent Luftfeuchtigkeit. Das sind Bedingungen, die ich keinem Kunden wünsche, dass er damit, dass er damit arbeiten muss. Ähm, aber wenn es denn vorkommt, kann ich ihm versichern, dass unser Gerät das mitmacht. I'm a product specialist, but basically I work with detectors. And what I really like about the system is that you can exchange the detector or put more than one detector into the system stack and it still looks uniform and they work perfectly together. The key benefit is that you can use one LCMS system and do a lot of different characterization methods like peptide mapping, intact protein analysis, glycan, characterization and so on with one LCMS system. So whenever you want to switch your detector, simply pull off one module out of the stack, put another one in, uh, so you can flip your entire system configuration within 10 minutes. Think of the unique charged aerosol detection technology, which would even allow you to quantify impurities in your sample without the need for external standards. Just take your shot, calibrate it on one known compound inside, and you can take this calibration for virtually any other impurity in this sample um, in a single run, which is also a very unique technology to us. So the precision that the instrument delivers you um, gives you a, a much higher confidence into your analytical answer um, of the question you are, you are looking for. Also in challenge was the new uh, variable wavelength detector. It, it achieves its specifications very easily and very repeatedly. So it's uh, very tolerant against, against temperature fluctuations and the, the lamps and it's warming up very fast. And with the diode array detector together with the light pipe flow cell, most customers will benefit from this instrument because they will be able to do measurements very close to the physical limit. 